But first at 11 o'clock, a 65-year-old woman murdered by a man on a mountain bike, and tonight the search is on for the killer. Good evening, everyone. I'm Bill Ritter. And I'm Shade Benner. And while the woman was shot several times and left for dead, Eyewitness News reporter Carolina Lee is live with a developing story in the Brighton Beach section of Brooklyn. Carolina? Well, Sade and Bill, investigators came here to the victim's apartment in Brighton Beach. Police sources say they found her boyfriend inside her apartment, that he is working with them tonight as detectives try to catch this murderer. Detectives worked the neighborhood Thursday night, piecing together every possible clue. The victim was here at the corner of West 2nd Street and Seabreeze Avenue in Brighton Beach just before noon. Witnesses say a man in his 50s on a mountain bike approached her, shot her several times in the torso, then pedaled away. We don't know what 65-year-old Ala Kamenex was doing here. Paramedics rushed her to Coney Island Hospital, where she was pronounced dead. It was a violent scene that neighbors can't believe happened on their quiet block. I'm surprised, you know, this happened here. You know. Yeah, but it's not usual thing. And uh, at the time also this happened, it's not usual time. It's scary because uh, we all have children and, you know, it's scary. Kamenix lived here on Surf Avenue, less than a mile away from where she was gunned down. Police sources say that detectives came here and found her 70-year-old boyfriend in her apartment. Investigators are speaking to him, and sources say he is fully cooperating. Well, the victim and her boyfriend, according to police sources, do not have any prior arrests in their history. The suspect is still on the loose. Reporting live in Brighton Beach, I'm Carolina Lead, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.